because I, took, I, was, I was compelled to understand the history, the history of the city. And once I understood the history of the city, I could see the nexus. And so policing and race to me is not mere training blocks of instruction or a work rule in a disciplinary manual. manual. Instead, it's that history that tells us and shows us day in and day out that these challenges remain for individuals of color and that for a police department to be successful, we must take that history into account in all portions of our operations. The last year has shown that we in law enforcement have a long way to go. And so what does it mean for law enforcement and the communities that we serve, all of them? And I think the key thing is getting the department, every department, to a space where they understand, regardless of a person's skin color, gender, sexual orientation, or economic status, we have an obligation to police consistently, fairly and equitably. And so to that end, I commit to begin my work here with a focus on rebuilding community trust, trust that I believe was already eroding prior to Breonna Taylor's killing. And I also commit to tackling gun violence. The number of deaths in this city last year due to violence, the homicides, is, is unacceptable. There's no excuses. We at LMPD must do better. I look forward to conversations with LMPD about all of that and what we are going to do specific operationally once I begin the job. In closing, I would like to take this opportunity to leverage the coverage to, to speak to LMPD and say to them, yes, I do see that there's an enormous amount of work to be done. I know that you're tired, you're fatigued, and you feel as though no one appreciates what you're doing. And yes, policing has become increasingly difficult over the years. But I will tell you, I love being a cop. I take pride in being a cop. And I take pride in our profession. And my experience tells me is that most police feel that same way. You want to do the job as you were trained to do it, and you want to do it well. And I, I believe, I firmly believe, that if we commit ourselves to the highest standards, we're open to hearing what the various reform recommendations are, if we're committed to being truly transparent, we're a change agent agency. We will hit and accomplish what the mayor has spoken to, and that is being the best police department in this country. Thank you.